Hello friends, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. So as you understand, I'm going to talk about top 200 engineering colleges in uh, India based on uh, the NIRF 2023 information. So NIRF 2024 is not out, but this is based on the NIRF 2023 information for the placement of 2022 batch. So what is the median salary of 2022 batch? Based on that, this uh, ranking is provided. So first is the tier one colleges, which are all IITs. So 23 IITs and last year around 17,000 seats were there in IITs which had taken admission through JOSA counseling. So I'm not talking about them because they are the tier one and they always are the best option. Similarly, all the NITs and all the triple ITs are also the college of national importance and, uh, you know, by default, they also will qualify for uh, the tier one criteria based on the quality of education and thing right so there were total 23,954 seats last year in NITs and uh, 7,700 seats in triple IT so these were all available and uh, uh, now I'm going to talk about the tier 2 colleges right so tier those are all tier 1 colleges and lots of review you would have seen of them right now talking about the tier 2 college they are actually not the tier 2 they can also be considered as a tier 1 because they have excellent median salaries so you can even consider this also as a tier 1 but since these are beyond IITs and ITs triple IITs I'm putting it as a tier 2 college but you can see the median salaries of BITS Pilani right BITS Goa BITS Hyderabad the combined you know NIRF data which they share last year in 2022 batch 2022 batch which was released in 2023 the median salary was 18 lakhs and they also have got the world ranking between 900 to 950 Similarly, DTU, like which has got a higher percentile cutoff for CSC and all right, 98% and above. Same thing with NSETU, they have got the median salaries 13 and 16 lakhs respectively. Similar college you can consider is the Dhirubhai Ambani Institute of Communication Technologies. There also you see the J mains percentile cutoff will be 99 and the median salary was 16.5. Same thing which goes with the IGDTU, which is Indira Gandhi Delhi Technical University. Cutoff will be minimum 96 percentile, median salary as good as 18 lakhs. And then you have a Defense Institute of uh, Advanced Technology, which is in Pune, right? One of the top notch India, India's institute, which is also a deemed university. You can see the median salary is close to 20 lakhs. And same goes with a highly reputed Jadavipur University, right? With a median salary of 10 lakhs and also figuring into top 1000 to 1200 best world universities right so now i'll further continue with some more tier 2 colleges right so this is i'm talking about velour institute of technology right vit main campus not all the campuses only vit main campus is also a good option to qualify to tier 2 college which is 10 lakhs median salary and a high visibility globally similarly thapar university in patiala right 10 lakhs median salary gs ggs ipu which is you know uh, in Delhi, right? So that also is 10 lakhs median salary and closes around 97 percentile. Similar, you know, high reported institute is LNMIT, which is LNM Mithil Institute of, you know, Information Technology in Jaipur with the 96 percentile around cutoffs for CSEEC branches and median salaries as high as 12.84 lakhs last year. So Army Institute of Technology Pune, same 12 lakhs median salary, Pek Chandigarh, high cutoffs, right? You will see 97 percentile and above 10 lakhs median salary. Bits Mesra, similar 97 percentile and 10, 10 lakhs around, uh, you know, median salary. Then you have Indian Institute of Space Technology, which is in Thuruvanthapuram, again 10.6 lakhs median salary. And Rajiv Gandhi Institute of uh, Petroleum Technology, which is in Amithi, right, which is Government of India. And there also you will see 10 lakhs as the median salaries. So those colleges are their tier two and the tier three colleges are also good options and they have also a very high median salary, but their visibility is only to the state level mostly and they do not have a world ranking and, and relevant infrastructure, but they are also excellent options for placements, right? So you can see Sardar Patel Institute of Technology in Mumbai cutoff percentiles are very high, 97 and the median salary is also very high, close to 12 lakhs. Similarly, COEP Pune, right, 97 percentile and 9.7 lakhs median sale. VJTI, which is in Mumbai, again, similar 9.3. J. Sangvi School in Mumbai, 9.3. 
Pune Institute of you know, Communication Technology, very reputed 10 lakhs median salary. RV College of Engineering in Bangalore, again 8.5 lakhs median salary. And BMS College of Engineering in Bangalore, similar option 8.24. So these are NRF 2023 information for the placement which happened in 2022 batch. Now these median salaries have also included heavily. Similar option you see Cummins College for Engineering in for Women right, in Pune where you see 8 lakhs median salary. Moving further, you have Manipal Institute of Technology, MIT, in uh, Mahe, right, part of Mahe, and which is a deemed university and very reputed college, again, 8 lakh median salary, and the world ranking is between 800 to 1000. ICT Mumbai, right, which is um, one of the best college for chemical technology in India, right, and 8 lakhs is the median salary, and the world ranking is also between 800 to 1000. Now, moving further, you have a PS University in Bangalore, also good reputation, state private university, 7.5 lakhs median salary. JSS University in, in Mysore, 7.2 lakhs median salary. You have Banasthali University for women in Jaipur, Banasthali, and the median salary around 7.5 lakhs and for the global ranking, 1,000 to 1,500. And then you have LPU, lovely professional university, 7 lakh median salary. You have JP Institute of Information Technology, JIIT in Noida, 7.6 lakhs median salary and a deemed dynasty. You have SSN College, which is Shivnadar College of Engineering in Chennai, which is a deemed university, median salary, 7.6 lakhs. You have SGSITS in Indore, which is SG Saksaria Institute of Technology, very reputed and the number one college in you know, Madhya Pradesh is also 7.6 lakhs median salary. JC Bose University in Faridabad, 7 lakhs, you know, state technological university. And Chandigarh University, which is a private university with lots of seat available, median salary, 7 lakhs. And similar is Chitkara, 7 lakhs median salary. This is as per the NRF 2023, Jami, Jamia Milia in, uh, University in Delhi, 7.5 lakhs median salary. Now moving to some other colleges in tier 3 category, you have Bharti Vidya Pit in uh, you know, Pune, 7 lakhs median salary, M Maharashtra Institute of Technology or MIT Peace University, WPU, 7 lakh median sal salary, Nirma University in Ahmedabad, the number of college, college in Gujarat, right, and deemed university, 7.5 lakhs median salary, Mahindra University in Hyderabad also, 7.5 lakh, Shastra in Tamil Nadu also, 7.5 lakhs, and all of these are decent options, you can go for that. HBTU, which is Harkat Butler Technological University in Kanpur, right? 6.5 lakhs median salary and one of the reported deemed universities. Then rest of the VIT campus, Vellore Institute of Technology, I will put it in the tier 3 where 6 lakhs can be the median salary and they were all state universities. Then SRM in Tamil Nadu, 5 lakhs median salary. Geetha University, 5 lakhs. Narsi Monji Institute of Management Studies, which has engineering department, 6.5 lakhs. And Amrita University also had the median salary around 5 lakhs. So some more, you know, uh, universities which will fit into the top 200 categories. So you see Manipal University in Jaipur, Kalinga, in you know, which is in Bhubaneswar, 6 lakhs median salary. Koneru Lakshmaya, again, in uh, Andhra Pradesh. 6.6 lakh, Anna University in Tamil Nadu, 6.3, Graphic Era in Uttarakhand, 6.25 lakhs, Nitta University in Karkala, around 6.5 lakhs median salary, and is also a deemed university. And I Mysore, UVC are some of the colleges you will get through KCT, Comet K, and they are also having good median salaries, which is 7.6 lakhs and so on, right? But many of them are state uh, universities, and some of them are deemed universities as well. So MSRIT Bangalore, right? very reputed college and autonomous institute, 6.2 lakhs for the median salary in the previous release. Siddh Ganga Institute of Technology in Tumpur also 6.5 lakhs. New Horizon College of Engineering in Bangalore, 7 lakh was the median salary for 2022 batch. So some more colleges from KCT, Comet K, like UC, and Niti Minakshi Institute of Technology, BMSIT, CMRIT, all between 6 to 7 lakhs median salary, Jain University, Christ University, which are deemed university in Bangalore. And then you have colleges, you know, uh, like uh, level 2 colleges in Karnataka, which is Bangalore Technology, Gokte Belkam, or RNSIT, BNMIT, VVC, all of those are like 5 lakhs median salary. So these are the overall 200 top engineering colleges in uh, India from based on the NRF 2023 and the placement details of 2022 batch. Thanks for watching and please do subscribe channel to get similar updates. Take care and bye.